Hello, this is Francis from McCaffrey's Craft, and uh, today I'm doing some more black thorn cutting. Uh, I'm crouching down here now just to make sure uh, I can, you can see what I'm doing. Um, here I'm in the process of just digging out this, this root ball. Uh, you see this, this tree there behind me. Um, so that's a good, uh, I don't know, I'd say about an inch and a half thick. So hopefully now it's got like a really nice handle on it as well. So we'll, we'll take a closer look now. Okay, so here's a kind of closer look at it. Um, this is a good close to an inch and a half tick and here I'm in the process of just just digging out the root um, You can see there's a root going this way, a root going this way, a root going this way And it goes off in so many different directions as you can kind of see um, There'd probably be a root down as well. So when you're cutting out a root ball uh, a stick or one of these fork type things or something like that just to kind of like, you know get an idea of where it's going um, you're going to have to try to cut all of these little roots and branches. If you start to pull and tug and yank in it, um, you can actually split the, the handle. So you have to be very, very careful when uh, when digging up a root ball and um, take your time because uh, root balls, they're, they're, you know, they're, they're highly sought after as well. And they're, they're tough to get. They take a long time to, to get. So here's like the, the, the tree itself. As you can see, it's, it's blackthorn. But given that it's a trunk, it doesn't have a lot of like bumps and knuckles because they come more on the branch. Uh, but this is going to be quite quite a nice stick once uh, once I dig it out. All right, so there we have it. We've kind of got it up now, and uh, as you can see, there was a lot of roots going in all different directions. Look, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Look, so many, um, and that's the tricky thing about digging out the root. They go in so so many different directions, and. Uh, you know, there'll be a nice nice handle there at the, the top of this one as well. Uh, so yeah, there's kind of the idea of like digging out the uh, the, the root. Uh, pretty exhausted from doing all of that. Uh, just kind of cleaning up now as well. But I just thought it'd be interesting for you guys to see, look, it's uh, it's quite, quite a difficult task. That's why you cut the easy sticks first. And then at the very end of your cutting se uh, session, you try one or two root balls because if you start cutting the root balls at the start of your cutting session, you're just going to be out of energy for the day. So cut the handy ones first and then towards the end when you're finishing up, um, you know, cut, cut one of these guys. Okay, thanks for watching. More cutting videos on the way. Uh, finally made it back to my shed here. And uh, here you have today's work, some uh, freshly cut blackthorn. Wait. This one here was that that root ball that uh, that I cut out there. It's actually quite quite a nice root on that. You can see it'll actually have a quite a nice handle. There's a little bit of the purple woods. So these are a bit older blackthorn as well. So that's kind of a first cutting session there. What about 15 sticks, I think. So uh, 15 down, oh, eight or 900 more sticks to cut. So, uh, yeah, just thought I'd just show you the kind of end result from, from today as well, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.